so welcome back to Holly's World. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Turn on post notification bells. Share, share, share. Come on, what, 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 what? A Holly's World member. Period, period, period. And so today, guys, we are trying to find the Mr. Beast chocolate in y'all. I don't know where it is, but we're gonna find it. So let's go. We're inside of Walmart now. So let's hope we find it. Let's go. Hey. Oh my gosh. All right, guys. So. We like only found milk chocolate, but we're gonna go to the bigger section because that was just a grab and go section. So yeah. So we did not find all the chocolates. That's why we're gonna go to the bigger section to find the chocolates. So let's go because we gotta find more of the chocolates because we're trying to win this ten thousand dollars. Like you can scan it on here, but like we have to win the ten thousand dollars. Like literally, we need a win. So. We gotta go find more chocolate so then we can get a lot, a lot of entries. Because we only found the we only found the milk chocolate, so we have to go to the bigger section. So let's go. And make sure y'all smash the subscribe button if y'all want more videos like this. Okay. new formula guys so like that's why we're trying it again because he did a new formula so there's one slim pickings i mean it was only a couple because some of them are um, nuts there's some hidden in the back of lilies you see that in the back of that Lily's chocolate. Oh, Lily. The other side. The creamy milk. Yes, that one. You see I'm hidden? Yeah. Why are they hiding the chocolates back there? They don't want people to get the chocolate. Alright, guys. So we found the milk chocolate. What kind is that? This is milk chocolate, but we already got a milk chocolate, but we it's just a whole bunch of dark chocolate sea salts. So we have <laughs> Dark chocolate sea salt and two of these like minis uh, milk chocolates. You had a you had a picture button at the same time. Guys, we forgot dark chocolate because they look the same. Like I thought these were the same. So we have dark chocolate sea salt, and now we just need the yeah dark chocolate sea salt. Dark chocolate sea salt. So, Hold on. now we have two of the mini milk, two of the mini milk chocolates because they didn't have the big bars, but increases our chances for that 10k. And then dark chocolate sea salt, and then milk chocolate sea salt. And then we can't get the peanut butter or the crunch ones, a because they don't have it, and a and b because we're we're allergic. So. Yeah. Them. We got the festivals. Emory doesn't even know that we're getting these, so he's gonna be surprised. But then he's, you gotta tell him that he can't get them though until we review them. Okay, guys, so we are trying Mr. Beast chocolates, the new festivals, the new formula. So let's go, and Emory's trying them with us. So we have dark chocolate, dark chocolate sea salt. We accidentally got two of those, but you know, it's okay. And then we have two mini milk chocolates because I didn't have the big milk chocolate bar. And so just in case you guys did not know, we entered ourselves to see if out of the 30 people we can win 100K, not 100K, 10K, 10K. So. We're going to see where you win the 10K by March 17th because that's what it ends. So you can still enter if you want. And then one additional person gets a year supply of Mr. Beast chocolates. So, yeah. So, we're going to... How we're going to decide on which one we're going to choose first, I'm just going to... We're going to do raw paper scissors shoe 
And so we can see which one to choose first. So which one do you want to try first? The dark chocolate. Sea salt. So he wants to try the sea salt dark chocolate. And I'm going to try the milk chocolate first. So whoever wants to have paper scissors shoot, we'll see. Ready? Back to back. Y'all see if he's cheating. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. This is the best out of three. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Well, oh, no. <laughs> okay. That's another thing. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Dang. Okay. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Yeah. So you have to try it. Show it to the camera. I want to open it. Fine, just open it. Let me use it. Fine. Oh, they last for a very long time. Like, they expire in like 2025. Okay, let's go. Oh, they broke. And that's because he was messing with them. Wait, let's show him the Mr. Beast. Let's show him. <laughs> what he do? Shout out to Mr. Beast. So, this is Dark Chapter Sea Salt. Don't get the whole thing. Just, we're going to break this one. So, you get that part. I'm going to eat Mr. Beast's heart. Wait, it will be Come in the frame. Three. Two, one. I'm not a fan of dark chocolate. I'm really not a fan of dark chocolate. If y'all want some ASMR here. But I'm not, I'm really not a fan of dark chocolate. But this, this, it's pretty good. I mean, I taste the sea salt. I tried this chocolate with the other formula. And it's way better because it's way creamier. It's way creamier and it's just better overall. And it's not too dark chocolatey as the last time I tried it. But what's different for, it was a different formula that I still like. Yeah, here. So what you, what do you, I already like a, 8.5? 9.5. Okay, tell it to the camera. 9.5. So 8.5 and 9.5. 9. 8.5 and 9. So what do you think can make the chocolate better, Emery? Look at the camera when you're talking. Maybe less dark chocolate. Less dark chocolate? What? Less dark chocolate, maybe. I don't know. So he said less dark chocolate. But it is dark chocolate. Okay. Emory's not a fan of chocolate either. Let's get water. We have to get water so, guys, everything can be fair. So, let me go with the water. I'm not a fan of chocolate, but I still like this one. You're not a fan of what? Chocolate, but I like this one. Okay, drink the water because there's chocolate on your teeth. So, like I said, I'm not a fan of dark chocolate, so that's why I'm not a big fan of this chocolate, but it definitely has made a difference than usual. And Mr. Beast, you did really good. For a person that's not a fan of dark chocolate, you did it good. But this is dark chocolate sea salt, so I don't know how his regular dark chocolate is going to taste. Get in camera. All right, so now we're gonna try. I said what to try milk chocolate. What are you gonna try now? Dark chocolate. Please let me win. Wait, I didn't say go. Rock paper scissors. Rock paper scissors shoot. Rock paper scissors shoot. Oh, <laughs> Rock paper scissors shoot. <laughs> Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. What? Okay. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. This is not fair. Drink <laughs> water so it can get off your teeth. Y'all just literally chocolate on his teeth, like literally. Swish it around in your mouth. Oh, yeah, I drink it. Okay. So while he's doing that, I will open the dark chocolate. Every time 
of his chocolate breaks. Oh, kind of. So you were feast. Oh, it says feastables. The other one, y'all. Wait, let me show him. Let me show him. The other one said Mr. Beast. Well, that one says feastables too. I think it says like Mr. Beast then feastables. But yeah, for the feastables. Okay. Three. This is you know this is dark chocolate, y'all. So here's a little close up. Three. Three. Two. That's definitely not dark chocolate because this dark chocolate, this one tastes like dark chocolate to me. This tastes like milk chocolate. What about you? I'm trying to taste this. It tastes like the dark chocolate. I feel like it doesn't taste the same as the other one. But I feel like this one's better than the sea salt one. Okay, Mr. Beast. Because the last time I tried his dark chocolate, I did not. I'm not paying that chocolate. But this, I could buy this chocolate any day and eat this. This may be my new favorite dark chocolate because I never really like dark chocolate. I was never a fan of it, but this is, oh, hold on. I don't like that aftertaste. The aftertaste isn't really the best because it just kicks in. But like overall, it's kind of good. So maybe like a seven just because of that aftertaste. So what do you rate it? A nine. Nine. He's ready everything at nine right now. Y'all, this is pretty good. Like I told y'all earlier, we did not get the peanut butter. I didn't see the crunch. Yeah, I need the crunch. I was not saying it too. But we didn't get those because they have nuts. So, yeah. But these are pretty decent. Like, you could... You could eat these every day. Not every day, but like... If I got some pies and Mr. Beast chocolate. I mean, I would be down to eat this. It's pretty good, though. All right, I mean, that's enough. All right, guys, so now, hold on. <laughs> now we have the last chocolate. Because Emery, we don't have any more white papers to shoot anymore. Because Emery really beat me at every single round to decide which one to choose from now. And what I've been wanting to try since the beginning is milk chocolate. This one looks like a pink one. So now we're gonna try it. Oh, this definitely looks like milk chocolate. To me, all of these chocolates are pretty good. You know, I actually get my name. It's okay. Or not. Wait. No. Yeah, you can take that one. This one looks like well, like a piece of it. Three, two, one. That is really sweet. That's really, really sweet. This is sweeter. Like, this is really, really sweet. It's good, but it's super sweet. <laughs> it's way too sweet. But I mean, it's a good milk chocolate. Cause, let me tell y'all, my favorite milk chocolate of all time is Hershey's. Literally, of all time, it's Hershey's. So, compare this to Hershey's. This is really sweet, so like, I don't know if I could do it. You know what it tastes like? It just tastes like, it's something like, not cream of wheat, but like, when you put a lot of sugar into your oatmeal, it tastes good. But like, it's good. It's a good milk chocolate overall. It's just really sweet. Like, you cannot eat too much of that. But, like, it's really... But it's delicious, though. Like, I like it. But it's really sweet. So, the fact that it's really sweet, I'm going to have to give it, like, a... But it, I was just really good. It's really good, but it's really sweet. Nine point. No. Just a nine. Just a nine. That's the... But this is probably, like, my favorite so far. I mean, like, of the whole thing. Of everything that we tried. This is my favorite. Emery, what about you? Ten. Okay. So, 
He breaks his a 10 because he likes sweets, so I give him something like this one. This one reminds me of a candy that's just really, really sweet, but super good. So now, drum roll, please. This is my ranking of the new formula of Feastables. Keep in mind, I tried the old formula of Feastables. And let me just say, Mr. Beast, it's a personal note. You really have improved on your chocolate. In your packaging is super good. Super good. So, in first place, milk chocolate. Second place, dark chocolate sea salt. In third place, the regular, yeah, the regular dark chocolate. I'm not a fan of dark chocolate, y'all. I told y'all. Now we're going to let Emery rank, rank his one, two, three. First is the milk chocolate. Second is the dark chocolate sea salt. And third is dark chocolate. Oh my bad, y'all. I meant to say second is dark chocolate sea salt. I, just, I feel like I just said dark chocolate twice because when I edit this, I'm going to be like, why did I say that? So, yeah. But, guys, let me know if you buy your Feastables. Buy your Feastables and tell me what you guys think of your Feastables. These are a must buy. Like, I don't know what you're saying, but like, these are a must buy. Definitely. Now, let me know if y'all try the other ones and you can tell me how they are. Oh, it also says Mr. Beast. Like, it's engraved in the chocolate and also Feastables is engraved too. So, yeah, y'all. Which one is this? I don't even know. No chocolate. But make sure you guys like, like, comment, comment, subscribe, subscribe. I need you to smash that subscribe button before I smash your chocolates, okay? Because we are trying to get to 1K by the end of March. Because, like, we are by the end of March, and I know we can do it. So, let's go. If you want more bangers, so make sure you like, <laughs> make sure you like, Comment and subscribe. They gotta smash that like. Smash it. <laughs> and so once you smash the subscribe button, and make sure you click the notification bell so you can be notified every time I post a new video. So now make sure you guys guys make sure you guys go buy your peaceables. Mom, thanks so much for watching this video. Bye guys. Peace. Look crazy. <clears throat> no. Okay. So, Daddy's gonna try the Mr. Beast chocolate. So, this is dark chocolate sea salt. This is milk chocolate. And then dark chocolate. What are we doing here, Bouncing? <laughs> so, you can choose which one you want to try first. Oh. Okay. Can I try? <laughs> oh, okay. I'll try the dark chocolate sea salt first. <laughs> it's not bad. Sorry. What's your rating? Um, it's about seven. Seven. Why? Because it's a seven. <laughs> I'm sorry. That's okay. What's the next one? No chocolate. Got ants in your pants. Alright, let me see this milk chocolate one. Chocolate one, maybe uh, eight. I get an eight. I get an eight. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's pretty decent. Uh, this is chocolate. Oh, it's another one. Chocolate, but I might have to get that one like a seven, so yeah, 
seven. Dark chocolate is seven. You get a sea salt of seven and a half, and I get a milk chocolate of eight. Thank you. So the milk chocolate is your favorite? I would think that's the one that, yeah, probably tastes the best out of them. Mm -hmm. Sea salt close second though. You just want to eat. What's your favorite? Eat all of them? <laughs> <laughs> eat all of them. Huh? My favorite is the dark chocolate people. Okay, okay. Yeah, fair enough. What's your favorite? Milk chocolate. Milk chocolate? Okay. Right. Great minds take a life.